uh, it's tricky. I've done Caesar a few times. I did it with Denzel Washington on Broadway, and we were very bloodied doing it. And for the life of me, we had real daggers. I can't remember how we managed it. I think there was were blood there pumps and bags. Yeah, and yeah there was stuff set up all over the place, and we'd right. give him a bit of a squish, and blood would come out. We'd come right. up covering ourselves and others with it. And, you know, we made some show of being bloody, but, you know, everybody knows it's a dodge. I remember in Act 5 in Caesar, underneath the stage, there were actually kind of little tubs of mm -hmm. fake blood. Yep. And we were instructed to go down and go into the tubs. Yeah. You just were left to, yeah. and then up you went. There was a lot of that. Caesar, of course, responsible for some of the finest direction, the best direction I've ever heard from a director ever. Uh, a protege of John Hirsch's, uh, Dan Sullivan, who ran the Seattle Rep as well uh, after he and under him while he was there, was directing the Julius Caesar on Broadway. And we'd come up and we'd, we'd finished a preview. And one of the actors playing Clytus, I think, who, which I'd played also, uh, when Brutus and Cassius come up, and I think Cassius may already be dead, and Brutus is coming up saying, please kill me. Uh, you know, and he asks everybody, and everybody says no. And then the actors disperse, and, and finally he gets somebody to do it. One of the actors was, was wounded, and he was playing wounded. And finally Dan said, what, what on earth are you doing? What's happening here in this scene after Brutus asks you? And you go off and you sit down over there. He says, well, I, I'm, I'm, I'm wounded, and, and I'm... I'm I'm tending to my wound. Yes, well, it's very interesting. It shouldn't be that interesting. Well, what do you want me to do? Just bleed. Just bleed. <laughs> this is the most perfect direction for an actor ever. What are you doing? I'm bleeding. Slowly the life runneth out. 